Hello everybody, this is Thomas Merrick, and I just wanted to do a quick, uh, well, quick, maybe not so quick channel update. Um, of course, some of you might have noticed I've not been around for about a month or month and a half now. Uh, partially just a little bit of burnout um, with the, uh, the Mega Mech campaign. Uh, <laughs> I've, I've been trying to put out uh, daily videos on that, and that's actually a pace I can technically still do it, it's just very repetitive, <laughs> and um, I'm still going to continue doing them, I mean, don't, those who are fans of that don't, don't think I'm quitting it, because I really don't want to quit it, but what I am thinking about doing is uh, changing a little bit the format of the way I do do it, um, uh, less updates, but maybe more condensed, uh, that way I can just like edit together and actually like cut out some of the dead zones, maybe actually have like one or two battles in a single episode, you know, depending on what it is, you know, maybe cut out some of the squash matches that, you know, it's pretty obvious I'm going to win or I'm going to, well, I say I'm going to lose, but <laughs> I say that a lot and then I'll try, I eke out a win, which is funny, but uh, partly that's just because of the AI, and there isn't a whole lot I can do about that, but uh, the, the whole campaign is still pretty fun to me, and I, I still want to... I'm still trying to tweak and improve things, but what I really want to do is condense down those videos and actually just have them less often. Uh, ideally, I might, depending, I guess, on the, on the week of battles, uh, maybe have an, an entire week, you know, just maybe have the highlights of the battles, and uh, you know, that would be one of the episodes. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of conflicted. On one hand, I want to like kind of speed up progression now, but at the same time. I've actually been trying to stall a little bit. Uh, I, I'm wanting to get some artwork done before the next uh, contract, uh, and I had well Stingray, who actually is, is, is the the guy who originated the concept of like these specific characters of Marlo Stingrays, and also did that that artwork I use for him. Uh, he, he's he's I mean he's he's vastly improved since he even did those. And, He's kind of offered to do some artwork for me before, and so I was just trying to get contact him, but he's busy. I mean, that is his livelihood. So, and I'm also been. <laughs> I think I think he has like time now, but I'm actually short on money now, so I can't really afford to compensate him for it. So, it's kind of a weird little conundrum I'm in there. <laughs> um. So yeah, I'm at, partly it's been stalling. It's partly it's. I'm just like I said, I'm conflicted. Uh, what I want to do, I want to go ahead and get the uh, this contract finished out, and then I might do a little bit of a pause before the next one. Because I was going to do a little bit of a pause anyway, because that is the end of the season. Um, the season concept sounded like a good idea back when I was doing it. I think I'm going to just ditch it and uh, instead just do what I've kind of been doing. A contract, you know, a playlist or is, is a contract, you know, one con, you know, that's that is a good breaking point anyway. And what I may still do, what I hope to be able to do, is still really highlight events in the inner sphere uh, because I, I got to looking at it a little bit closer here recently, especially after I've gotten some of these books that kind of go over the eras, and we. Uh, uh, some of the eras, or some like the, the, the things I wanted to highlight, for example, the Fourth Succession War, is only two years long. Whereas other stuff like you know the clan invasion is seven years long, if you really want to get into it. Uh, the other things, the Andurian Wars, the Ronin Wars, uh, War Thirty Nine, uh, some of those they overlap. You know, so I can't really do a a season on even one individual one because well, they overlap. So, <laughs> um, instead, what I'm hoping to do is just go ahead and just do a like a like a, a what are they called vignettes? Just like little you know, mini videos. I do cinematics. I think what I call them. Uh, they just kind of go over the story, kind of kind of prep you for like what the background stuff is, and then how the Marlowe's stingrays you know fits into it. Um, I've, I've got a lot of ideas of what I want to do for the next contract already. But uh, that's where we stand there. But something else I'm wanting to do is 
I'm wanting to shake it up a little bit as far as like the content on my channel. Uh, one problem with Mega Mech is it is very dry to look at. <laughs> it isn't, you know, it isn't graphically beautiful. And if you're not a fan of BattleTech, it's it's kind of rough to really you know, sit through a video, which means you ain't gonna watch it. And you know, I, I would kind of like to, to grow the channel. And, and also just, I'm, I'm interested in more than just Battletech, so. Uh, some of the things I'm thinking about doing is, some of it's just like, look, kind of a quick look, one-off type things. I, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of, like, Tycoon games, which, you know, and here not too long ago I tried doing uh, Mad Games Tycoon, and, eh, it kind of got mixed reception, plus I wasn't really doing very well in the game, so I was kind of not really into it. But, um... I'm thinking like maybe doing like just one off, maybe you know, kind of show off the game a little bit, do a scenario. For example, Big Farm is one I've really been playing lately. And I've really been enjoying it, and it's, it's pretty easy. I, I could do a scenario in you know, one or two videos, really, depending on I guess the scenario. But so that, that's one I'm kind of thinking of doing. But even beyond that, like strategy games are also like a, a big thing for me. Is one thing I really want to do is uh, a Stellaris game. Uh, you know, modded, unmodded, I'm not sure. Probably, probably modded. <laughs> I like playing unmodded, you know, to just to get, like, you know, go for, like, achievements or whatever, but, man, you, I, I miss those mods sometimes. There's a lot of really great content out there. And, uh, so, you know, that's something I'm thinking about really delving into. And plus, games like that, particularly if I don't have to edit them together, I can just, like, record it. And then, then, you know, put it up there. That's, that's what a lot of people do. Uh, you know, when, when you when you throw in, like, editing and so forth, like I said, I do... Well, really for every Mega Mega video, but, you know, the ones where I actually get in and actually do the cinematic, so that's sometimes an all-day process. It, it really is. Uh, partly it's just me being picky, which... <laughs> I guess sometimes I'm not picky enough, but... Uh, <laughs> I still make mistakes on those sometimes. But... You know, some of these other videos I probably won't do like intro and outro, or at least not as far as like an extra little thing like I do with Mega Mech. Just because, you know, that cuts down a lot of time and I can sit down, record, put up some content, and, you know, we can judge it from there. And there's other games too I'm, I'm actually interested in trying to show off. I mean, I've really been into MWO in a big way here again. Uh, I've, been, I've been playing with. Uh, the Headhunters of Davian, and uh, just, you know, every night we'll <laughs> they'll have a, a faction warfare group going, and I'll join it, and then that'll be my night. I'll, I'll spend all night doing that, which is also partly what hurts me actually putting content up on the channel. But uh, I am thinking like maybe do, throwing up some videos. I've actually had an idea to do like a ride along with the Stingrays type thing, where I'll, I'll load up MechWarrior online, and let's say. You know, Carl Marlowe is currently in a, a Cyclops, so you know, I, I, you know, we'll, we'll do a couple matches as you know, as though we're riding along with Carl Marlowe in a Cyclops or whatever. I know, I, I've really, I've, I've really been kind of thinking of doing that, uh, actually, for several months now, and I just haven't actually pulled the trigger on it. But you know, there's other ones too. Uh, I kind of want to. I play a little like World of Warships every once and again. Uh, Dreadnoughts uh, kind of got my interest. Um, I, I might I might do a video on that just to kind of sh showcase it a little bit. Uh, there, there's there's all kinds of games. I look on my my Steam list here. It's I've got I've got games out the wazoo. <laughs> Some of them I wouldn't want to do a video on. The other ones I wouldn't mind it. Yeah, you know, like, like Tyranny. I, I wouldn't. That, it's an RPG. It's one I really want to play, but I don't. I think I'd want to like do a video on it, you know, a video series on it, because when the games like that, those, and then you have like the Telltale games, I enjoy the Telltale games, you know, pretty much all of them that's come out, I've really enjoyed, but they're not something that, I don't know, it's not something that I feel comfortable recording and showing, because it is, the, the whole game is the story, and if I'm recording it and showing it to you, then... <laughs> I don't know, it just seems kind of, uh, not shady, but, you know, 
I don't know. It, it just seems weird, you know, from a from a perspective of you know they release this stuff to make money, but if I'm like showing you everything that's in the game, why would you buy it? You know, so I'm not depriving like the. the it's it's one of those weird things because you know, you get into like copyrights and like YouTube and other people do it and as far as I know, I mean, big names do it. And they you know, they don't apparently don't get copyright strikes on it or, or any kind of flag on it. But it just seems really strange to me that, that that's the case. Of course, then again, I guess a lot of these Telltale games have like this crowd, you know, for streaming like, like crowd voting or whatever, which is a really weird concept for me, you know, for <laughs> for, for a game like that. Uh, but anyway, yeah, I guess rambling a little bit, but uh, those games, I, you know, I have them, I enjoy them, but I probably wouldn't do videos on those. But. Uh, as far as like when I'm going to get actually get back to recording some stuff, uh, as far as Mega Mech is concerned, it might be a couple weeks yet. But I I am thinking of going ahead and like popping up some, some more videos, which is kind of why I want to do this update video. I wanted... I was going to. I was thinking about posting up some videos that weren't Mega Mech, and I didn't want people that are fans of the Mega Mech stuff to, you know, panic and think I'm not going to do it anymore. I am going to continue doing it. <sighs> but anyway, I think I've been rambled on quite long enough. Oh yeah, we're coming up on what? Twelve minutes. Well, uh, I guess you've had your soothing tones for me. What is that? ASMR? I need to find some scissors. <laughs> uh, won't be doing ASMR videos. Not that I'm necessarily against them. They're just not going to be me. <laughs> okay. Getting into weird tangents. I actually want to do some actual video recordings. And while it's still cool, you know, that's another thing. You know, the summer here, the, the heat really wrecks me a little bit, you know, saps my energy. And, you know, when I'm in here with a computer going, it gets, even with, like, you know, I've got air conditioning, i got fans, I, I still get way too hot in here. <laughs> so, you know, that's, that, that plays into, like, you know, my, my productivity. It seems like every summer I, I really slow down on this stuff. If, if not just altogether, just drop it and then come back for a month. But, as is the case here. So let's, uh, let's, uh, go ahead and close this out, and I'll get to recording something. I'm not too sure yet. Yeah, not too sure yet which one I'm going to do. Uh, probably Big Pharma, because that's one that's really been... E well, I'll explain that when we get into that video. So, until next time, Crash and Burn.